Hello everyone, welcome back to Walk With Me Gaming. We're doing another round of Binding of Isaac today. So, let's see. Where should we, what should we do this time? Have we unlocked any more? Oh, we did! Oh, we got Azazel. Okay, so, y'all remember in the first playthrough I got Brimstone, right? So, well, Azazel kind of has permanent Brimstone. Um, so this character is unlocked by doing uh, three or more devil deals in a game. Um, and, however, his, his brimstone laser is shorter, so um, it's not quite as effective as the regular one, but as you can see, it is still very strong. And, uh, very, uh, no, that's awful. I'll come back. Hopefully I can get a bomb or something to get rid of that, because that, that, that's a terrible item. Ooh, yes! Petrified poop. <laughs> the things we get excited for in this game. Watch out for this guy. Ow, really? I didn't think I was that close. Hmm. Alright, so... Come on. Oh, there we go. Bomb. Okay. Uh, so, in some of these... I think I saw some of this on the last one. But if you get a room that has uh, this machine, you can bomb it to get a different item. That one's, uh, that one's a little better. We can we can walk with that uh, temporary enemy slowdown. So it's not super strong. Um, you can tell how good an item uh, a, a, ch a usable item is by how many charges it takes. So this only takes two charges. Only takes two rooms to charge. So clearly it's not super strong. But uh, but hey, it'll it if it'll get the job done. That's what matters. So we'll slow him down for a, for a second. Slow, slow him and, and all his buddies down. Alright, come on. There we go. Our little harbinger. Meat cube. <laughs> so these are fun. Um, there's a lot of references to uh, Ed Mc, Mc, is it McMillan? Um, to his uh, previous games. Um, like Super Meat Boy and, uh, and uh, Time. Time. I'm not going to say the full thing because it's the F word. Trying to keep this still relatively uh, f speech friendly, uh, even if the the game itself is not exactly uh, appropriate. But uh, you know, whatever. We 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 all have our standards. This is my standard, so you just have to deal with it. I won't use the swears. Ooh, no, oh, really? Useless. Get me out of here. Thank you, card. So he starts with the full card, which is nice. I don't know why he would start with the full. I wonder if that's a reference to something, because um, with him being Azazel, uh, who is, I believe, a biblical demon, um, obviously there, there's usually something related uh, when it comes to stuff like this, because everything has some sort of hidden meaning in Binding of Isaac, um, and it's oftentimes some sort of uh, biblical meaning or um, I don't know but uh, I don't know couldn't tell you the tarot cards are nice anyway um, oh okay this guy is a nice little distraction so sometimes enemies will chase after him instead of me so very beneficial at times um, let's see Yep, get the little guy. All right, so after I bust these poops, I'm gonna I'm gonna take the other trinket, cause uh, this can be nice. Bag lunch. So if you get hit a couple times, the bag lunch will actually drop uh, the lunch item, which is uh, looks like a bowl of dog food maybe, um, <laughs> but gives you a health up. So it can be nice. See, look at that. He's attacking the little guy. He got confused. He thought he was the enemy. You were wrong. Ooh. Let's see what we got in here. Oh, okay. Well, um, well, this isn't super useful. So this would give me spectral tears, which means they can pass through objects, and uh, flight, which, considering that I have both already, uh, that's useless. And this guy is not good enough to pick up. He leaves a trail, trail of blood that can injure enemies. That is not enough. So we're going to move on. Um, I'm gonna keep on, keep on rolling. 
You know what time it is. Ah, uh, well. <sighs> Wasted that heart. Oh, well. Got a key out of it. Not so bad. Oh, this is great. We don't us I don't usually get this many soul, soul heart drops like this. It's actually working out pretty well. No, we are not getting bum friend. I want something useful. Little monstro. Mm, maybe. We'll come back to that. We'll see if we can get some more bombs. I don't want to waste my coins in case I can get something good in the shop. Or maybe even just upgrade the shop a little bit. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Little, well, I mean, little monster is okay, but I think we can do better. I'll take a fly. I like the flies. That's a strong fly, too. Perfect. I need some tears up. It takes forever to charge. Alright. Let's see. Hmm. This looks like a wall where a secret would be. I was right. That sucks. <laughs> uh, oh well. Let's see if there's anything good in the shop. Nope. Well, maybe. Here. Here, you can have my coins. Really? It stopped there. Two, like three coins. Alright, fine. Guess we'll just have to move on anyway. Um, do this. Just so these are easier to kill. Haha, -ha, took you out together. Like you were on a fancy date. Uh, anything? Oh, alright. Bob's brain. Fair enough. We'll take a Bob's brain. We got lots of we got lots of followers in this game. Lots of little buddies helping us out. Bob's brain and my fly and the meat cube. All these all these are nice little friends who can help out and sometimes hurt us. Specifically Bob's brain. He can he can hurt us a lot. <laughs> but I'm usually pretty good with it. It just takes practice. And mainly realizing to not just be holding the button and expecting him to, to fly into the enemy correctly. Because usually he won't. <laughs> ah, okay. Alright, we're making we're making good time. We might actually get to uh, the boss rush. Maybe we'll do that as a good uh, a good way to do something different in this playthrough. So um I, dev I, I knew I wanted to play another of just like the regular levels because gre greed can see just hurt myself with them because uh, the like the greed levels can be fun but um, I feel like this is this is where the real experience is this is where the real game is that you want to play so you know I know that comes down to personal preference but that's 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 my feeling on it so ooh um, do I go with it? Yeah. Goat head. So goat head means that these doors will always stay open and will always appear. So um, very good if you like to get lots of devil deals, which I do. Um, obviously, you have to sacrifice your, your health for it, but uh, as, if, as long as you know what you're... As long as you know what you're doing, it, it can be a worthwhile sacrifice. Blow them up. Oh, come on. Get over here. Here we go. I found pills. Well, that's not great. Alright. You! You want to be careful there, because if I was standing that close and he and uh, Bob's brain went off, that would have been a problem. There we go. Hey, that was, that was some smooth work right there. Well done, Mark. You're doing a fantastic job. Okay. Okay, blow him up. Ah, use it on the bug. This guy, this guy's spitting. All right. Um. Hmm. I don't want to waste a bomb, just in case. I don't know which one's the right way. 
All right. Well, hey, I'll take that trade off. Bomb for a key. Ooh, another fly. I might end up getting a fly transformation. Not too shabby. Yep, there we go. Slow you down. You will die. Alright. Well, don't need that. That's a useless card. That gives me flight, which I already have. Bob, you are you are struggling. There we go. And we got another 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 fly room. Really? That hit me? Come on. Hmm. Oh, that was so close. That would have been cool. That would have been a good hit. Uh oh good. We only have one red heart, which means we can go in here. Ooh, nice shot. Now this is a good one to use that slowdown for since this guy moves so fast. Ooh. Destroy the peep. Destroy the peep. See, look at that fly. That fly does some damage. <laughs> Almost got hit. Uh, oh no, 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 no. Oof. Don't want to lose that. Don't want to get hit and accidentally miss out on a free lunch. Haha, <laughs> gotcha. You were fooled by my decoy. You are foolish creatures. You deserve to perish. Haha. <laughs> Oh, I should have tried to save them. That could have been that could have been a secret. Well, got plenty of bombs now. It was a secret. Hey, hey, I'll take it. I will take it. <laughs> Just kill him. There we go. Okay. Oh no. See, that's where it can be really bad if you accidentally use the Bob Brain incorrect. Really? I'm getting hit a lot. I don't like it. And there we go. Blow him up. Get stomped. <laughs> That's right. That was an easy battle. Hey. All right. Cool. Um, yeah, might as well. Look at all that health. Give me a good item. Uh, yeah, I'll take that. Give me fear shot and damage up. I will take that. So fear shot, um, there are so many effects in this game. It's crazy. Like... They, like, so many items do different things. You can burn enemies, you can poison them, you can slow them down. Uh, but for this one, the whole goal is, uh, yes. Actually blew it up. Ow. Fine. <laughs> um, but the, the fear shot makes them, uh, afraid of your, of, of, of Isaac. It makes them, makes them run away from him. So, uh. Can be can be beneficial. Also, can be annoying if it's an enemy that usually runs at you because it means that you have to chase them down. Uh, and if they suddenly change their minds in the middle of it, they're gonna keep running after you. What do we got here? Useless. Oh, really? Do not harm me. Give me your coins. We're still under. Yeah, we're still under, but under time. So, uh, are we on the fourth? No, or yeah, fifth level. So, depths depths one. We have to get to depths two. Um, I think we can accomplish that in under twenty minutes. 
because uh, that will give us the boss rush. Really? How did I still get hit by that? Ooh, Hierophants. Thank you. I accept your sacrifice. Uh, I still have not found the item room, though. And I would really like the item room. But... Ooh, cool. So, with war here, that means we can get a... Uh, ooh, dang it. Really? Uh, we can get uh, an upgrade to our meat cube. Because what happens is uh, you unlock multiple meat cubes and they all uh, combine into a meat boy. Uh, so right now we just have meat boy head. But then later on, uh, if we get more, we get more stuff. Uh, hmm. I do always enjoy the pentagram and I've had it through the last two playthroughs so might as well get it now. Um, but I do want the item room. Before we move on, I really would like an item. Ooh, wait, I saw a thing. Ooh, okay, make sure I don't forget the bomb rock there. Definitely don't want to forget that. It could be free soul hearts for me. Keep on moving. We're moving quickly. We are making haste. Ow. Too much haste. I need to slow it down if I'm going to keep getting hurt. Doesn't matter how fast we are if I die. Alright, come on. Ooh, nice. Alright. That was a good box. Give me that. I found pills again. How insignificant. Alright. Ooh, I don't remember what this one is. Oh, adrenaline. I think you get uh more more damage as you get damaged i think that's what that does not 100 percent boom look at that we almost missed that that's a free heart right there excellent all right moving forward going down ah uh, yes so okay i thought it would make move on to the next thing but uh yeah so once you've killed mom uh, the first time, uh, you unlock mom's, mom's heart, which is the next, the next place. So, after we beat mom on this round, we actually get to progress further. Um, but like I said, if I get it in under, if I get, if I beat mom in under 20 minutes, we also get to do a boss rush, which I definitely want to do, because it's a lot of fun. Um, get out of here. With that weak stuff. What, you think you can compete with me? I am a demon. Alright, come on. Where is... Seriously? Alright, well we found the end. Where's all the good rooms? Give me items. That is not... That is, that's not okay. We don't do that here. Paralyzing things. Unacceptable. Okay, gotta go back. I'm gonna find the good rooms. I gotta go back. And unfortunately, because after this, you don't get item rooms and shops. I am getting real sloppy here. It's very disappointing. Haha. <laughs> you have been blown up. That's... Not great. Not not really. Not 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 great. No. Pheromones. Those are also not great. <laughs> okay, come on, give me his item. This could be. This is this is nice. Ugh. And a useless pill. Really. So the magnet, yeah, shows uh, as as you can see, uh, pulling in items towards me. Because that's what magnets do. Uh. Okay. Come on. We got we gotta 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 do this. I like that the magnet doesn't pull items that are useless to you. So like the red hearts, because I don't have any damage, they don't do they they don't need to be dragged towards me. But since I need 
Since I can take blue hearts. Gosh, where is this? Okay, there's the shop. Please be... Please sell things. Oh, okay. Wait, yes. Oh, that is. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, all right. Steam sale. So we could actually probably get uh, another item. Do we have enough time? Probably. Hmm. More bombs. Not exactly useful right now. Mm, that's not useful either. No. Come on, give me something good. I said something good. Oh, that was accidental, but uh, actually was really good. That was actually one of the best things we could get. Okay, I should go. Uh, I should go fight mom now. Otherwise, I'm gonna run out of time. Ah, I still never found the item room. Can I? Uh, seriously? How many more are you? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Where, where is it? Oh, wait, I already did find it. Oh, I'm so dumb. Okay, I got a minute. I got a minute to beat mom. I have to beat her. Uh, this is gonna be, this is gonna be cutting it close, but I think we can do it. We got a lot of strength and we got a lot of friends to help. I think we're gonna be okay. Oh yeah, we'll be fine. Ah. So the the little guy really helps with this one because it can direct mom's foot from instead of stomping on you, it'll stomp on the little guy. There we go. Excellent. All right, and we got time to decide if we want uh, some more upgrades here. Um, no, none of those are good. All right, so boss rush. What do we got? We got damage up and we got this glass, which I forget what it does. So we're going damage up. And we're also using our strength card because why not? Um, all right, we're gonna slow things down a little. Oh boy, yeah, we're gonna definitely, definitely slow him down when we're fighting this guy since he's one of the worst bosses out there. All right, so what we got here, so boss rush is basically, if you get to mom in a, in a short enough time, um, you basically get to have a giant battle against, uh, I think it's 16 waves of bosses uh, from all throughout the game. So it's it's all random, like everything in this game. Um, so you don't know which bosses you're going to get. Uh, some of them you might get harder ones like the angels or uh, or, uh, or or the, the fallen. Uh, other times you might get uh, just the little poopy guys. Um, <laughs> I don't know what, I forget what their names are, but I think the little poopy guys is descriptive enough to let you know what it is. <laughs> Slow them down. Ah. Everything still seems to be moving really fast. Like, I, I feel like, whoa, what, what, what did I just get hit with? Seriously? Nice. Oh, that was perfectly timed. Gotta slow down death before he slows down me. Good. Good, good. Alright. I hate catching. Catching that is the most annoying part of death. What do we got here? Got Mr. Mr. Gertie. No, that's not Gertie. Um, I forget this guy's name. There we go. Kill the devil. Normally the mask would be hard, but since we have our our ability to shoot through things, the mask is super easy. Still hurt us, but you know, whatever. Not a big deal. Whoa, that was some distance that guy had. <laughs> we hit him accidentally with Bob's rain without even planning to. See, there we go. We got an angel. Oh, I was like, I was like, did I already finish it? Oh my gosh, it's ridiculous. Oh, he was chasing after him. 
There we go. Come on. Mr. Mr. Shooter Guy. Ow, really? Going to hurt myself. There's Gertie. What's up, Gertie? You big pile of flesh. <laughs> Gertie used to be uh, in the original Binding of Isaac game before this got like remade. Gertie was literally the worst, the worst boss you could fight. It would, it would, it just wrecked everyone. It was like so, it was so overpowered. It was ridiculous. <laughs> All right, all right, all right. Come on. Get rid of the angel first. There we go. Very nice. Nice murdering. Oh, hey. That's actually really nice. So, shielded tears. So, when you have brimstone, that basically means if I'm shooting my brimstone laser, nothing's coming through it. So, that's actually really good. Okay, cool. So, now we get to go. Now that we've defeated Mom... We have to go into the womb. Yes, it's just as gross as it sounds. <laughs> Utero. So more, more creatures that look like weird things. So these ones are kind of, I don't know if those are supposed to be like tumors rolling around or what. And then these horrible little worms. <laughs> Hopefully these aren't actually crawling around inside of people. Ooh, uh, no, I still, I'm still waiting for my lunch to become effective. We got the chariot so we can sneak out. Ooh, okay. Hey, free guppy item. Nothing wrong with that. Can't go wrong with gups, even though we probably won't get a full guppy transformation on this one. Um, that would be nice. Um, there we go. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Let's see what boss we got. Uh, the bloat. Poss probably this may be the hardest boss in this game. Um, the only one that I hate more is Skolex, and it's not because he's hard, but because it just takes forever to beat him. Ooh, range. That's hugely useful when you're a Zazel. Um, that's a worthy trade. Absolutely. Damage up, speed up, all that's good. Sure, moving on. Alright. We're gonna get to we're gonna get to mom's heart. We're kinda we're kinda speeding along now, but uh, you know, a little shorter episode ain't so bad. Um Especially, as long as I don't die, because that would be the worst. I don't want to. I don't want to die. I'm. I'm. I know I'm better than that. <laughs> oh, let's see. These horrible masses. Get. It. Yeah, there it is. Good shot. Good shot, Bob. The horrible vagina monsters. But they do kill other enemies, so they're not so bad. <laughs> I just realized, like, I'm, you know, that's not a bad word. It's just not appropriate to say, you know, I don't know. I guess whatever. This game's weird. You guys already know that. You, you've, been, you've been watching me for this long. This game is weird. There's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> You got a problem? Write to your local congressman. Oof. These guys are maybe my least favorite of the regular enemies. Because they pop around. You never know where they're going to show up. They shoot multiple shots at you. And the worst part is, if it's in a room like this, um, if they're popping up on the other side, you don't know where they are. And just finding them is a pain. So it makes clearing out the room just an extra hassle basically uh all right we're go wow this is i'm like that is so strong i can't i can't get away okay uh oh hey well there that's something stop shooting me oh gosh oh no i'm doing really bad stop hitting me 
This should not be this hard. Those guys are the worst part. Is the those stupid eyes and their stupid lasers. Those those are easily the worst part of this battle. The rest of it is pretty manageable. Especially because she kills her own enemies too, which is nice. Alright, save that save that save that Bob brain. Get her. Ugh. This is where that, that short range really makes it a problem. Alright, we did it. We succeeded. Uh, well, we could move forward. But maybe we'll save that for another day. This will be our ending. Oh no! Poor little Isaac, he's so sad. What does he find in the box? And there's a whole bunch of endings. There's like 30 different ending type, like ending things like this where you find like different items or different abilities and stuff like that. Oh, we unlocked Eden. Yes. Eden's a cool one. Um, so maybe we'll do that next time. But uh, um, yeah, Eden is cool because each time you beat Mom's Heart, you get an Eden token. So you can only play this character if you have Eden tokens. Um, but it's randomized. So just to add to more random in this, uh, it gives you... Uh, different stats, different abilities, and you start with different items. So uh, it's a really cool character to play as. Lots of fun. Um, but that was good. That was a, that was a good run. So um, hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, I obviously have lots of fun playing Isaac. I think next week we're gonna do we're gonna play in my 100% completed game, so you can see a whole bunch of new items, a whole bunch of new abilities. And um, just uh, see what what this kind of what the end game of this holds. So um, uh, if you liked it, uh, leave a comment, like the video, share it around. Um, hope you guys uh, enjoyed this. And if you're still craving something to do during uh, during your isolation at home, this is a great game to spend a lot of time on. So uh, definitely worth checking out. So. Uh, thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time. Bye.